Welcome back to the Zoltan Cruiser Run of FTL. We're rolling through with our big old turtle. We got three turtles on board and a new NG called the Cubbin. Alright, let's see, we're jumping out of a plasma storm into another plasma storm. Or nebula. Sorry, not an actual plasma storm. <laughs> and now I say it and of course it's going to be there. Let's see what we can get. Upgrade that. Is this weapon offline? No, it is not. Alright. That didn't take any of their weapons offline. It's unfortunate. Hopefully their little bomb does not enter to my shield room. That would not be good. Let's see, fuel, missiles, and scrap. Mm. Alright, I'm going to accept their offer. Just because we're in an ion storm, so... I kind of want to make sure that my people have oxygen. Don't want anyone to die from that. Plus, we did get a quite a bunch of fuel and missiles, which are worth their weight in scrap. I have a lot of scrap saved up here. I should definitely start upgrading some of them. What is going on? Still in a plasma storm. Damn it. I guess I don't need that to be powered up yet since they are in cloaked mode. Wait until they fire. Okay. I'm trying to determine whether I want to hit that cloaking system or not, but I think I could destroy them anyway in one hit. Should have just checked that out. All right. Let's upgrade these engines. Of course, can't actually activate them yet. We'll check out that store on our way out of this nebula. Maybe go do a little V. little V formation down and up. Let's see if there's any distress signals down here. Nope. Another store. Well... It may visit two stores this time. Okay, so traveling merchant. Shield charge booster. That is always useful. Let's grab this. Do I want another person on my ship? Possibly yes. Someone to attack borders is always nice. So I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna pick up the mantis guy. Get some fuel while we're here. Um, hmm. Hull beam or hull missile? I'm gonna stick with the hull missile and sell that guy off. And now, let's keep jumping though. Why? Oh, we have no oxygen yet again. Where are you guys telling me about this oxygen, huh? You just want to see all my people asphyxiate? Okay. So this is when we're going to start needing our missiles. Alright, Allison, you can go chill out in the med bay. So see, we need that missile to bring their shields down to one. Otherwise, our halberd beam would not be able to penetrate the enemy ship at all. And there we go. Oh, nothing useful on the station. That's unfortunate. I still want to check out that other store. Just in case they have laser weapons. That would be very nice to have. A bribe. Sorry, pirates. I want a better bribe. I 
gonna actually shoot my hull beam this way, or sorry, halberd beam this way, just so that they have more systems they have to worry about. Good thing I got my mantis man, just in case this crew tries to teleport onto my ship. And I am sorry that these fights are going to take a little bit more time. Alright, lots of fuel. Now let's continue the assault though. These are some dirty pirates out here. Yeah, these battles are going to take a long time because we've got to wait for this halberd beam to charge up. And dang, I knew that somebody would come in here. There goes your ship, Rock Dude. See you abandoned just in time. Oh man, only 20 scrap. An arms dealer? What is this? This ain't no arms, little drones. You tricked me. I should have accepted that bribe. Oh well, live and learn. I'm very cautious about my fuel now, ever since we're running out of it. It does suck sitting there. In fact, the rebel fleet came and attacked me three times while I was sitting there. So once you're in the the red circle of the fleet status, they can just fly away mid-battle and then come back fully repaired. So like, hey, they went to go re get reinforcements. AKA, hey, remember how you were kind of almost destroying them? Well, now you're screwed. They're coming back at full health. All right, too dangerous. Hell no, let's explore the asteroid field. Hell yeah, free stuff. I love free stuff. All right, it's almost time to check out that store. Let's see, can I go down, up, and around? Let's try it out, why not? Nope, just an empty area? Yes, this is gonna work perfectly. Oh no, some mantis. Yes, this is very bad. Very bad, but not completely and totally terrible. So let's put that laser. I think I can get all four of these spots. Yes. There we go. Now these mantis are screwed. Of course, they're going to abandon ship and come on here. What? Did you just send your NG guy over here? Why would you do that? Come on. That's easy pickings for my mantis, man. He's just going to slice them up. All right, we are loaded right now. Let's get some good weapons over here. Okay, I said good weapons. We could get another crew member, which is always useful. Let's buy this scrap while we're here. Nah. Screw getting a new crew member. Let's upgrade our ship. All right, first our weapon systems. Then we're gonna go for some, yeah, let's up these shields right now. All right, so now I have enough to power up these hull missiles. Yeah, that'll go work well in conjunction with this halberd beam. And then we'll power up our shields. Sorry, rock dudes. You guys would be pretty awesome on board, but gotta power up this weapons and stuff. Oh, all right. Let's attack this slaver scum. These guys are screwed. And then I can get a free crew member, hopefully. Actually, this hull missile can be quite damaging to the enemy. Yeah, 
here we go. This will do, what, four damage? It'll probably cause them to surrender. What? They're trying to escape. Escape is not allowed. All the things you could have done. Escaping is not your option. Oh, here we go. Thank you. Now we we'll, shall take one of your slaves. Another mantis man? Hey, why not? Who knows what we may be getting into. Slug control nebula. Probably not going to be a lot of... Oops, sorry about that. Probably not going to be a lot of borders out here in this slug area, but... You never know. A distress signal. Okay. Okay. Let's kill some slugs then. Uh-oh. They got three shields. That is not good. Actually, let's power that one down. We're gonna have to do a lot of damage to these shields. Wow. They got a lot of weapons on there too. Before we can start using that halberd beam. Alright. Let's keep up the damage on here. There we go. Let's see, how do I want to do this? I'll just barely reach across. Alright. Taking some minor damage here. Hey, go help him repair that. Guess we're taking lots of damage here now, unfortunately. Okay, one guy to repair here, one guy to repair here. Hopefully once we get that halberd beam back up, these guys will be dead. Yeah, they're toast. Alright, that worked. I was a little worried there when I saw how many shields they had and how many weapons they had. <laughs> More ungrateful for my assistant. What's a, what a bunch of rock jerks. Alright, just a little bit of healing and then we'll jump out of here. Okay, we're ready to jump. But one thing I want to do first is actually upgrade our sensors. You guys may be wondering, why am I upgrading sensors in a nebula where I'm not going to be able to use them at all? Well, that's because upgraded sensors allow you to track ships in here better, which could be useful for gaining more crew members as well as hunting down other enemy ships. So that's why I got my level 2 sensors. Oh my goodness, more pirates. Okay. So let's start blowing up this shield room. Power this down, power that up. Power the big old missile in there. Alright. I would definitely like some laser weapons. Just so I could take these shields down to get my beam in there. Because I'm going to be running out of missiles very quickly at this rate. Okay, let's kill this guy who's in there. Then we'll cut across this way. Oh, he did not die. How unfortunate. My weapon systems are taking a beating. Okay, let's get that halberd beam charged all the way up so I can kill these guys. No, nah, you're you're gonna die. You were way too annoying to let go. Awesome. All right, so a little bit of healing, and then we'll get out of here. Alright, we're ready to jump. Let's continue on our way through this slug nebula. As you can see, it is definitely getting a little bit more difficult. 
Now these enemies have three shields on them. Oh my goodness. More enemies with three shields? Are you kidding me? I'm going to start running really low on missiles. And that's going to be unfortunate. Hopefully this one hits, actually. I should wait to see. Yes, it does. Dang. They are quite quick at repairing these shields, unfortunately. Come on, all missile. Oh, man. Perhaps I should just concentrate on blowing this ship up, actually. I don't think my halberd beam is going to be able to get in there. So I'm going to target these empty areas and blow them up with the hull missile. Seems like the wise course of action. Let's hope this one hits. Goodbye, Mantis. Alright. Get a couple more missiles. That's useful. Hopefully I will find some laser weapons soon. Otherwise, it's going to get difficult. Oh, man. These assholes. Alright, how about we have no oxygen? Who am I to judge? I don't know. Seem to be kind of a jerk. We'll cut across this way. Wait, hold on. Let's actually wait for our missile to fire. And hit. There we go. Good. Boom. Suffocate on that. Alright, these slugs shall die this turn. Goodbye. Yeah, you may have taken out my oxygen, but I took out your entire ship. How much oxygen is out there in space, suckers? Alright. Let's actually... Alright, I'm actually going to save my scrap, just in case... Oh, thank goodness. I found a store. Alright. Give me some laser weapons. That is not any laser weapons. We already have a shield charger. Guess we can repair up a little bit. Buy some fuel while we're here. And keep going to the next store. Alright, laser weapons. Fingers crossed. Damn it. Alright, automatic reloader. That's very useful. And... I guess let's buy up some missiles, since that's what we're going to be using. Let's keep going through this area. Oh, man. Alright, let's attack it so we can get to the station. I am immediately regretting this decision. Oh, wait, nope. You gotta hit this guy. Luckily, it's an automated ship. So once we start taking down its shields, it won't be able to repair them. Okay, great. Let's fire another little Lido at it. There we go. I'll fire our big hull missile there again. Just to hopefully take them completely out. Alright, these guys are at our mercy now. They should be dead this next turn. Excellent. Let's investigate the station. Alright. Another anti-ship drone. I mean, not another, but... A anti-ship drone. Could be useful to either sell or maybe get a drone control system. Oh, I'm going to provide assistance to slugs. No, that's that's false. We are going to kill them. I don't even care if they were pirates or not. 
I know what slug people do. Like, can I actually get that across five different sectors? Oh, wait. Hold on. Let's let our missile fire first. Almost wasted that halberd beam attack. Here we go. Yes, we can get it across five sectors. That is awesome. Sorry, pirates. You're gonna die today. Oh wait, no I didn't. I missed that engine room completely. Let's try that again. Hmm. Maybe I can only get across four sectors. Nah, someone will tell me in the comments, they're gonna be like, just a little bit to the bottom and a little bit more to the right, like two pixels each way. You could have done it. Well, if so, please do let me know. Yeah, let's chase these fools. Aw, oh, come on. I had my sensors here. Dang. That does allow them to get very close to you. Oh, well, we're almost to the exit anyway. Aw. Oh. What do you mean we don't know how they got past our energy shield? They're freaking engineering assholes. Alright, let's hunt them down. We gotta be on the ship somewhere. And fire this. Aha, they're down here. Hey, what's up, slug fools? Meet my mantis fools. They're gonna slice you up. Okay, let's hope this one hits. Oh, a miss! That is unfortunate. Yeah. Eat that, you slugs. Uh oh. They are very likely to get hit and killed, which is unfortunate. Hopefully they do not. In fact, I shall... kind of mitigate my losses by putting them in two different areas. Targeting these enemies with our halberd beam. Ooh. I wonder if I can actually dodge these attacks with my men. Can I, like, see where the missile's coming in and, like, move them at the last second? Oh, let's... Oh, no. Um, where is this headed? Let's look at the point of attack. Yeah, it's going definitely into the med bay. Um, run here. Or run here. Oh my god. That was a complete and total fail. Why'd they have to blow up my med bay? That's not cool. Okay, now I can repair the oxygen area. Dang, who is that? That was Allison, the person who I hired. Uh, see, he has slave strength. He was able to survive with one health. Alright, so a little bit of healing, and then we'll jump. Okay, we're ready to jump, but before we go, let's upgrade our engines. I want to upgrade my weapons sometime soon. Those high evade chances are always very nice. Alright, nothing to do here. Next sector. So, Zoltan controlled or the homeworlds? Well, it doesn't matter either way, so I guess we'll go to the homeworlds. But as we are jumping into sector 5, I'm going to cut it here. So, join me next time as we go to the Zoltan homeworlds with our ship, the Turtle. Take care of yourself.